Hello there Stephen, hope you're doing well. It's Ben here from Medans in Christchurch. As promised, thought we'd do a short video walk around for you of the Skoda Octavia VRS in which you have inquired. So like I say, this car here does come from Skoda Milton Keynes. You can see down here with the registration plate, probably used there from someone at the head office. You can see it is in very good condition. These cars that come into us from, from Skoda are obviously well looked after, um, kind of as demonstrators. There is obviously front parking sensors and rear parking sensors on this car. As you can see here, wheels all in good condition. The brake discs themselves do look a little bit rusty where it's been sat a little bit. They will be in good condition obviously due to the age. There is a little bit of rust coming on there onto the kind of centre of the disc but that's just something that does happen over time. It can be cleaned up of course with a wire brush. Nothing kind of structural. Down the side of the car, obviously you've got the black wing mirror caps rear tinted windows as well with this black accents running all the way around black roof bars as well like i said with a panoramic opening sunroof as well like i said this this centerpiece here does move back over here um kind of giving you a nice nice experience there back wheel same thing again brake calipers all looking good nick with the red paint on there and the wheel itself obviously wrapped in the bridgestone pretender tires from factory in the back obviously you know the octavia vrs very well um this generation you've got the really nice red stitching and here obviously all the ice fix points are counted for usb c ports down in the back as well for the charging you have this really nice alcantara on the door cards as well um like i said it's a very nice place to be um and a very well looked after example we have got the twin tail pipes down the back of the vrs you also have the automatic opening tailgate which you can use via the key or by pressing the button in the boot here you see obviously we've got everything from Skoda so like I say you do have underneath this false floor here you do have a space saver spare wheel located down there obviously with your floor mats all in here with bits and pieces so obviously this would get fully valeted for you but obviously everything comes with the car as it's served such as obviously partial shelf and things to close it down you just press the button up here does the job like I say, there are no major scratches or dents at all on this car. Obviously coming from Skoda. So it goes for this rear wheel here in good condition. Calipers, and once again, it's just the, the disc there do look a little bit of build up rust. But like I say, that will obviously come off, of course. Get down to this last wheel here. See the centre there of the, the hub looks in better condition. No rust on there. And the wheels themselves again. Once again, really nice condition. So moving on to the driver's seat now, obviously we've got the VRS kick plates down here with the seats themselves, we still actually have the stickers on there from new down there, obviously we've got the really nice VRS bucket seats here digital driver's display up ahead with the VRS flat bottom leather perforated steering wheel really nice, really nice touch and obviously then you've got the newer design um, controls down here for the gearbox so to get it started now, brings up, you do have heated front seats in here. Like I say, no wireless phone charging, I'm afraid, but you do have USB-Cs in here um, for charging. Got Android Auto, Apple CarPlay features. Obviously, you've got your gear selector here. But yeah, overall, does require a good clean panoramic roof there. But yeah, very well looked after example. Um, will, of course, need a multi-point inspection. Um, so at the moment, as you can see, it just needs some washer fluid in there. So it will go through... Um, our workshop be inspected make sure everything's up to standards if it isn't it does get replaced but for a car of this age um, like I said I highly doubt there's anything there um, to be concerned about otherwise like I say the car is pretty much ready to go a bit of fuel um, so yeah do let me know your thoughts any questions be happy I'm happy to help thank you very much